So some rather interesting news popped up on my timeline um, on Twitter. Uh, according to Al Sacco, he covers the 49ers, the co-host of 49ers Web Zone, uh, No Huddle Podcast, he, formerly of KNBR and the Niners Wire. He um, he posted something about the um, Matt Mayoka podcast. And it's he he's quoted as saying, as Kyle Shanahan reached out to Jimmy Garoppolo and Jimmy was very disappointed uh, the 49ers made the trade that they did, you know, to get up into the top three. Uh, and according to Matt, uh, Al, Sa- Al Sacco, he's just saying this is his opinion. And I quote, let's use common sense here. I highly doubt Jimmy will be back or would even want to return at this point. Just a matter of when. So, uh, you know, there's been a lot of stuff that's been said and a lot of things that have happened over the past, say, uh, I don't know, two, three months towards the end of last year about, you know, and Jimmy has been totally positive and it's been totally positive And, uh, you know, they wanted to let Jimmy know they were still on board after they made the trade and everything sounds all good and great. According to Matt Mayoka, though, who's a very credible source, I mean, if he's saying that Jimmy Garoppolo is very disappointed, I mean, it looks like the end, really. Um, it's not specific. It hasn't been said and nothing has happened yet. But if you read the tea leaves on this one, and I mean, it's very obvious um, this bridge may have finally been burned. And, you know, you feel bad in a way because he's such a nice guy, Jimmy. But we're in the business of winning and you're in the business of trying to get better. You're in the business of trying to put players on the field that stay healthy. Uh, Jimmy is a winner, but a lot of contributing factors go into that. You know, play calling, running game, defense. What I think the Niners are doing, and uh, it'll definitely, they'll, it'll say a lot if they draft either Zach Wilson, Trey Lance, or Justin Fields. If three, any of those three are drafted, it will be apparent that the Niners are looking to upgrade their quarterback to a to a playmaker and to someone who they can rely on, who they can put their trust in who doesn't need to have uh Kyle Shanahan make them by the plays that he calls and the offense he constructs they need somebody that can uh, rely on their own athletic ability and make plays and uh do it on their own sometimes and uh use their own god-given talent I think with Jimmy is Jimmy's very efficient in Kyle's offense but how much of that is Kyle and how much is that is Jimmy and, you know, the, the, the great quarterbacks are able to play outside the confines of their offensive uh, scheme and sometimes just play straight up, uh, you know, sandlot football. So I think the Niners maybe hopefully have seen the writing on the wall of how the other league, other quarterbacks in the league are. And they're finally, you know, jumping to the modern era and leaving behind, you know, the one dimensional pocket passer. Um, but that I could be totally wrong and they'll, they'll draft Mac Jones and then everybody will be pissed off. So we will see. We got about a month. Um, can't wait. Uh, my appearances on YouTube are going to be a lot lim- more, uh, limited because I will be going back to work hopefully in the next couple weeks, but I'll try to make stuff as soon as I can, um, when I'm available to make it. Um, But until then, I just thought I'd share this with you guys and let you know what you guys think about this article. And, uh, you know, what do you guys think? Do you think uh, it's unfair what's happening to Jimmy or, you know, it's well-deserved? Let me know down in the comments below. If anything else changes, I'll let you know. Until then, as usual, I'll see you on the flip side. See you guys.